Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy King Sprint. Now, I want to talk in this video, but I was muted because I was trying to get some clips and I forgot to unmute, so that is my problem. Another thing is we are showing off, you know, the new Flash Fist Crux. Here's the thing though with the festival version. It is broken. And what I mean by broken is I don't think they meant to do this and I don't think it was tested, but oh my goodness, it, it can it freeze you. I when I block when someone was blocking and they went for uh, and I went for flash fish skewer. I said flash fish skewer, flash fish crush. Not only were they stuck until I hit them, but if you wanted to, you could keep them like that and just let the time run out. If you really want to be like that, but yeah. That's one of the things that's broken about it. Another thing that's broken about this skill is... Well, it can actually delay the, you know, limit... the When people, you know, actually pop their limit bursts. I've seen it where it just delayed it, because here's the thing. I, it was like two seconds... A, it was two seconds before they activated it, and then it took them a while to actually activate it. So that's another thing, which means... By that time, if somebody really wanted to, they could have followed it up with another Flash Fist crush. Oh, and I don't feel bad for what I did to him because, you know, he fought with Super Armor. I would have if he didn't, but yeah, no. I, I didn't. Anyways, yeah, this skill is, it, it needs to be patched. Another thing that happened, it, it, you'll see in this fight, but when I fought the person and they had super armor, I did flash fist skewer, and it s temporarily stunned them, and not stunned, yeah, it did stun them, I don't know why I was gonna say it didn't, but yeah, they were able to get out of it because it was super armor, but if, the, if they did not have the armor, it probably would've, you know, stuck, so yeah, no, dims, please, please patch this, I, I like, the new flash fist skewer I, see, I, see, I keep calling it flash fist skewer the new flash fist crush but i don't think that it should allow me to freeze enemies like it's a time skip deadlock or whatever it's called but this guy managed to grab me from that far don't ask me how but he did you want to go mui psych nope now here's the thing it, i had to get better with the timing but yeah, you saw it right there. They they were temporarily stunned. But no, the um, I, I'm getting better and better with the time and people actually going into MUI now. I actually wonder what takes longer, Beast or MUI. But at the same time, I I don't want to test in an actual match. I might have to just test it on my own. And yeah, the, that guy got me with the key stun, but that's okay because he's. Overly, overly reliant on back hits, so I can take advantage of that. And I did try to go for another flash fist crush, but instead what happened was, you know, I missed. Yep, thank you for going right through. Uh, I can't talk. Thank you for using all that stamina. I appreciate it. Let, let's get you with another one. And another one. Oh, I'm not done yet. Flash fist crush. And then jump spike. Give up. Because, yeah, Flash Fist Crush can combo into Jump... I, I mean, Jump Spike can combo into it, but yeah. I, I like that combo, but I also like doing flat, you know, Flash Skewer into Flash Fist Crush and then following it up with the Jump Spike, if I can. Have you picked a strategy? But sometimes it can be risky because if they recover fast enough, and I mean after, you know having no well yeah if they can recover especially by the time they get their stamina back that's leaving you open but yeah no this zamasu he he was he was you know fighting me a little too aggressive at first but then he started switching things up and that definitely put me in a bad spot because it made me have to come to him but at the same time i can't be too mad because as you can see, I am the aggressor. I am being so aggressive in this situation when I should really have him come to me. I should be trying to get stamina back, but yeah, nah. I, I was just tunnel vision. I was like, yo, let me hit you. 
But no, that flash skewer completely missed its mark. It's in this fight where you actually see me stun the guy, but that was not on purpose. I did not try to do that. This skill is just, you know, is glitched and needs to be patched. And when it does get patched, I wonder how many people are going to be like, wait, I can't stun people like I used to anymore. But yeah, nah, I, I was not trying to freeze this guy. It just so happens I froze him. Now, I ain't gonna lie. What I did was completely disrespectful because I, I could have given him a chance, but I was like, this match is so close to ending. Yeah, uh, actually, I'll, I'll just save it. I'll just save it for when it happens. Because, oh my god, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't have to do him like that, but the fact I did it, it, it was completely disrespectful. And I do mean completely disrespectful. Because look at it. He, he did try to hit me with Heavenly Arrow, I think that's what it's called, but I'm like, nope. Alright, he burst that. I think he's trying to run out the clock, but instead what happened is he got caught with the Flash Fist Crush, and I'm like, okay, can I get him again? He's stun locked, so I'm like, time skip Molotov, and yeah, like I said, completely disrespectful. I did not need to do this. I, I could have given them another chance, but I ain't gonna lie. I, I wanted the win. But yeah, no, they definitely need to fix that. It should not be able to just put somebody in a deadlock like that. It's, it's completely unfair to those that have to fight against it. Or don't know that they're gonna end up getting frozen. <sighs> so, I thought it was poetic that... The guy that I ended up getting again was the one I fought in the second match. So, yeah, that's actually funny because this is the fourth match now. So, yeah, I think that light stamina break was a misinput and I got... Speaking of stamina breaks, I don't know why I went for that. But, yeah, no, I was trying to keep him low stamina. Eventually, I do break it, I think, at one point, And I was trying to time the limit burst so that I could backstep and still punish him. But... He has super armor and yeah, you can't exactly punish them unless you have like a grab type of move or you go for a grab itself. And what I mean by grab type of move, I mean something like super goth is jump spike or gigantic rage, all those stuff. Cause even though they're not, you know, actual grabs, they're, you know, treated as grabs because they have Actually, let me rephrase that. Even though they're not grabs, they have grab properties, if that makes sense. Which means, if you also hit somebody with a super god fist, you're gonna go right through their super armor. And by right through it, I mean it is gonna treat it as if you grab them. That's what I mean, but yeah, no. I was just a little too late to stop him activating MUI. Okay, that that is fine by me. Go for it, go for it, buddy. But yeah, he, he tried to hit me with Soaring Fist. Miss, you're gonna actually see that a couple of times with this guy because he, I think he likes the Soaring Fist with, you know, the MUI because that's what your keyblocks get re replaced with. Soaring Fist, and if you charge it, it's, um, I'm actually trying to remember. I think it's, I almost call it Spirit something. I'm trying to, I'm trying to remember. Comment down below if you know because I, I forgot. Oh, I'm um, Spirit Paul. Sorry, sorry. Never mind. But yeah, if he just somehow grabs me from that far. Don't ask me how, but Buddy keeps trying to get me with, you know, Ultrasonic Blitz. I ain't having it. Mmm. There goes your MUI. Here, hold this. Hold this. Oh, wait, sorry. My mistake. I completely messed that up. Nope. And it froze him. It froze him. On that note, I will catch you guys later. Peace. Have a good rest of the night, everyone, or day, wherever it is you guys are at.